How's it going guys? Just another real quick video. I uh, made some more advancements on my 3D printed drone today. I printed the top of this. Um, and so that makes it so that I can have different levels of, I don't know, just to mount stuff on. So I still have my breadboard down here with the Arduino Nano and the um, inertial measurement unit. And then right here I've got my power distribution board. Uh, I also got some new 30 amp electronic speed controllers instead of um, the 12 amp ones I was using. And I made a hunch that my problem of only two of the four motors turning on was due to them somehow not being able to pull enough power from the battery. And I think that I was right about that because um, they work just fine now. And it's able to, well, I got all these soldered together and uh, got the motors themselves soldered to the ESCs. So it it's able to balance it. And when I um, have it turned on and I, I tilt it, it tries to correct itself and uh, it responds well to the controller as well. So these propellers are 3D printed <clears throat> and as soon as I actually get it flying, I will make a video about how well they perform. Um, but I also have some others coming tomorrow that uh, I ordered and just to be able to do it. And I want to make sure that it functions nicely and that I don't wear anything out, um, at least as I'm starting out and trying it. And then I will actually try to use some of these 3D printed propellers to just kind of see how functional they actually are. So um, it is really nice to be able to print all this stuff and not have to like buy, <coughs> excuse me, a body and <coughs> a frame for the drone. So anyway, just kind of rambling on about what I've done with it so far. So I'll actually be testing it hopefully tomorrow and be able to show you some footage of that. So make sure you don't miss that by hitting the subscribe button and hit the like too. It helps out. So thanks you guys so much for watching and we will see you in the next one.